Just about every historic home has a wooden window or two that's difficult to slide. Today I'll show you a simple trick to help you lubricate your wooden windows. The soap trick, sometimes called the candle trick, is an easy solution. Any soap, candle, or other wax will work. All you do is rub the jam and open the window a few times to spread the wax. This will keep a window sliding well for years. Wood shrinks as it ages. You'd think that would keep a window from getting stuck. The most likely problem is latex paint binding up the jam. Originally, the sides of the window and the jam were not painted. The wood was oiled to keep it smooth and lubricated. Modern latex paints are basically rubber and that rubber is the reason these windows are having trouble sliding. This video has been on how to get a difficult to move window sliding more easily. If you have a window that doesn't move at all, check out my other video on how to unstick a frozen window. If this simple trick doesn't help your windows, you may have a more serious foundation or other structural problem. Wooden window restoration is a big deal for historic homes. There are many videos on my site about this topic with more coming all the time. Do you have questions about your wooden windows? Lots of people do. And if that includes you, I want to hear them. Please leave your comments and questions in the comments section below. I'll answer you there. A few years ago, I started reaching out to neighbors to help with various issues relating to our historic homes. As I took notes and spoke with local experts, I began to think about the best way to share what I know. The result has become VallejoHistoricHomesSupport.com. The website is a video blog series that's meant to encourage preservation and increase our enjoyment of living in historic Vallejo. It's been a tremendous labor of love, and I'm excited to share it with you. I'm Chris Jacobson, a local Vallejo realtor, and I love our historic homes. Your comments and questions are important to me. Please share your stories. I read every comment, and I hope to hear from you there.